Hi everyone, it's Elizabeth at the Coastline Library and I just got a question where a student asked, how do they use the online library? And what they were really asking is how do I search the online library to find stuff for my classes? So let me show you how to do that. First, you're gonna start on the library webpage, which is coastline.edu forward slash library. From here, you're gonna click on eBooks and databases. So here you have some options, and I'm just gonna walk you through three different ways to search the library, starting with my favorite way, which is to look down at the databases by subject. So the library, all of our content is organized in what are called databases, and the database names don't always make sense. So in the library, what we are always doing is trying to organize the content by subject. If you're not sure which subject to go for, I always would start at the general databases. And what you can do here is you can click on the database name and that will take you in. You might have to log in with your credentials, the same ones you use for Canvas. But under each database, we have a short video tutorial that shows you how to use the database, which I highly recommend. So here, this is how you get in to search the database. Like I said, we have lots of content here. If you need help finding a certain database or you have a certain subject that you're not sure where to start, you can always contact the library. The second way to search is to be is on the same page where it says search the library. You can click on library catalog. And here in the library catalog, in theory, you can search all of the library content. So here I'm going to do my quick search. And as my topic comes up, it's going to give me different information. So if I get something that says book, that's actually an electronic book because at Coastline, we have an online library. So it's accessible to all of our students. So you can go through here and you can click on any of these options. Just really quickly over here in the left navigation menu, you can see that it's sorted by resource type. So if you're really just looking for a newspaper article or a journal article, you can click on one of those and that will give you the results that are just those items. And here, what happens is you can click on the title of the article, it will bring up more information and then you can click on the option where it says full text available. And basically what this will do is just bring you back to those databases we were searching originally. So the third option to search is that the libraries linked some of our journal content to Google Scholar. So you can click here and log in to the library and then it will take you again to Google Scholar and it will bring up the library content in addition to other journal content if that's what you're looking for. So I hope this answered your question. If you have any other questions, you can always contact the library. We're happy to help you. You can text us, call us, email, we'll Zoom with you. And when we can, we'll meet with you face-to-face. -face. We also have library workshops that go into more detail about different topics. And if you'd like to enroll in those, you're welcome to do that. That information is also on the library webpage. You can just look under library workshops. All right, I hope this answered your question. Have a great day, bye.